Ladies and gentlemen, I'm NoGod21, and welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei 1. In the last episode, we finally made it to Shinagawa. Excellent. I had to kick a demon summoner's ass, I had to get out of Ginza, but we're here. And in today's episode, we're, it's going to be focused on gathering strength by leveling up, making some, get some new demons, and get myself a brand new sword. The sword's probably going to take forever, though. Yeah, cause Shinikawa is not for story progression. Well, at least not yet, I think. Cause the actual story progression is back in Ike Bukuro. Ow! Fuck that's hot. Okay, before I go anywhere else, though, I need to heal up, so let's head to the healing shrine. How much money do I have? Not a lot. Because I also need to finish buying uh, armor for Yuka. We have our HP and MP. Heal up the ones that benefit the most. That way, we can just do this. First, key, heal yourself up. Excellent. Okay, and then on the first floor, Shinigawa, we can find a core shield, which I'll probably sell. Two Atosis incenses and a speed incense. Okay. And I have a map that tells me where the damage tiles are, so let's go through. We exit the door. Oh, it's one of these floors, isn't it? Hang on, I need to be facing this way. Here. Down here. Through this door is our first incense. Yay! Another intelligence incense for the bag. Here we are. Intelligence went up. Which means I need to... Yep, I still need to level up three times. Ugh. Ah, uh, Persky, hello. Hang on, what did I see there? Mahanma! Okay then! Yuka, you! Sweet child! You just became a lot, a lot better deal. We just became a lot more powerful against the undead. Excellent. Which means I don't really need to fuse a fucking law demon anymore. I could probably dismiss them from my party. Or use them and not have to worry about it. Uh, let's buff up this. Let's do that. Okay, and you guys have been bound. Excellent. And they're going to die this turn anyway, so fuck it. Yuka, could you cast the mapper spell, please, so I could have a, uh... Thank you. Okay, if I'm outside the room, let's face north so I can get a baron. Let's see. 
Everything else here is rooms, which I'm assuming have NPCs in them. Am I right? The road to Messiah and Head Church is a hard room for those who don't follow the philosophy of law. The halls themselves are designed to attack unbelievers uh, that try to walk them. Though apparently a course can negate the trap's effects. So yeah, that NPC just tells us that this place is filled with trap floors that if you're not lawfully aligned, you take damage. So, if we have a group of lawful demons and, Ka and if Kazuya was on the lawful, lawful route, then we wouldn't take damage, but Yuka would. Seeing as how most of us are not lawful though, we're neutral, we have to avoid those tiles. Okay, let's go up through here. And just auto kill the mage. I'm gonna be assuming there's gonna be a lot of cultists in here. And it's a full moon, so I can't talk to her, so fuck it. Goodbye, Lamia. Ah, Rajanaga. I kinda wish I could talk to you, because I wanna get you on my team. Wow, they are fucking dodgy boys, aren't they? And of course she escaped the bind immediately. Do, 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 do. And just auto. Goodbye, Rajanaga. Okay, from here we need to go through this room. to be start being careful here because we're slowly getting up to the places where oh Jesus Christ uh. <laughs> all right well here we go um I don't think this will work so I'm gonna try just to test it Okay, and thankfully Reflect is not that much annoying in this game. <coughs> Where because in later titles I hit a reflected enemy with the fucking AoE spell, my entire party would get hit by it. Or at the very least, the part Yuka would have gotten hit multiple times. Oh, I'm so glad it doesn't work like that. Okay, that's two that enthralled, one can move. And three are bound, so this is an easy round. Keep reading the Hobgoblin has no special abilities, like a dipshit. Actually, Hobgoblin cast fire, see if they take any damage from it. Well, he can't do that if he's shocked now, can he? You know, I wish they would make auto bat the auto button actually do the your best attacks against the groups. But that would require scanning and memorizing enemy weaknesses. Which they figured out how to start to do that back in Persona 3. <sighs> I miss extra other features now. God damn it. Okay, let's try that again. 
you don't take that much damage from fire. So I'm guessing you guys are either weak to ice or wind. Or maybe it's just because Hobgoblin's magical abilities are absolute garbage. It could be that. I mainly use him for buffing anyway, so I guess I really shouldn't complain so much. I wonder, do these buffs stack multiplicatively or additively? I actually need to look into the fucking damage calculations of, the, of these games sometimes. Gun, gun, extra, attack, attack, attack. I definitely want you got one of you one of you guys on my team. Holy fuck, you have a lot of HP. Thank you. Oh great, a single person person. This would be easy. Get zapped. That was almost. That was practically a half of Persky's HP in one attack. Ah, oh, so we're back. Great. More enemies. This is what I wanted, though, so I can't really complain. And I don't think Hama's gonna be very good here. Does Zama do anything to you guys? Yep, that coffee is definitely a bit more fruity than than yesterday. Okay, so... Yeah, I just had to let the beans sit for a few days when the bag was opened to get the uh, fruity accents to come out. Okay. It's a medium rose, the fruity accent are not as pronounced as a light rose would be, but it's also probably the type of bean that it is. Well, that was worth a thousand experience. Okay, we go up here. Go here. Okay, now it's time for me to start being careful. Oh, lackeys again. At least this time I don't have to deal with a giant group of you assholes. And hang on a minute. This guide also has a chart of all the uh, all demons that have alignments. Which means I can actually get the neutral here. There we go. Gun, gun, extra, extra, buff, attack. Okay, that works. Ok, 
Okay, we have to go this way. Okay. We're at our first crossroad. Let's see, this is facing south. Hang on, let me reorient for your orientate myself. Map. Yeah, the crossroad is where the first damage tile is. So we're gonna go this way instead. Yukis, they are chaos demons. And jockeys are light demons. So Shikis, Yojus, Jujins, Yoseis, Majus, Tokis, Seireis, and Shinjus I can recruit without any issue at all. But later on, I think I'm going to be locked out. Hmm. Well, actually, since you're a Yuki and I have two light demons, let's try to get you on my team. Might as well just go threatening. Accept the challenge. Intimidate. That worked. Ryuo. You are chaos. You're a neutral chaos at that. Well, yeah, neutral chaos on the light spectrum. Which means I can talk to you. Sup. Identify. Join my team. Here's an orb. I think I have a garnet. Yes, I do. Let's try again. Unfazed. No. Well, that didn't work. Seriously though, if you can't cast magic spells, why do you have an MP bar? Just have it be dots like Kazuya is. At least that way I don't have to worry about misclicking magic, or don't have the magic button be an option. Okay, and they're bound, so auto battle. Alright, I got a new demon out of the po out of the out of the thing. Rajanaga. Oh yeah, I also have Ibaraki. Okay, so I have two lawful demons and two chaos demons. Ibaraki. Ooh, you could debuff defense, that's useful. Rajanaga. Zionga you can buff defense. Ooh! Well if you come across a boss, I know who I'm having with my team. Okay, well, wait. Ibaraki, you're level what? 38? Correct? Yes. And Rajanaga is 40 something, right? 41. Oh, so we're. <laughs> we were on the cusp of actually being able to recruit him. Go figure. Okay, Rusulka and Kustiv have to go. Windigo and. Kwonka, I don't need anymore. Considering that you guys learned a. The, one of the best. Huh? Okay. The higher. A, God damn it! I better hum a spell. There. So I can ditch them. So that's one, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I have ten demons max right now. I need to find another memory board to get up to twelve, so I can't recruit any more demons right now until I fuse up four away. Okay, let's move on. Here. Hey, Ibaraki. Thanks. Hello, Loa. I was, wasn't I expecting to see one of, one of the old faces here. Yoma. How are you a law demon? I don't get it. How is something like you a lawful demon? That doesn't matter. Eat this. If you're anything like you usually are, you're not going to like this spell at all. Oh my, you reflect it! 
That's not good. Oh, why do I have to make assumptions on previous things? Uh, well, at the very least, you don't reflect physical attacks, so that's a bonus for me. If I ever run into fucking Grim Grimmikahulka, who does, I am fucked. Well, I don't... Can guns be reflected in this game? Because I think you need at least one damage type to get through when nothing else works. And usually that's typically gun when it's there. Ah, whatever, one low is down. It's nice to see that Loa has kept his same design, the only difference is the snake color. Ah, Wendigos, hello! Is that a B in my window? Oh, sweet Jesus, that's a B. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. Oh, great, because I looked at the sun- I looked at my window where there's sun coming through like- Oh, I got it, I just blinded myself. That's great. Eyeballs, focus up. Oh, I can't tell if they're outside the window or not. Oh, jeez, this is gonna be a mess. Spider and the windows are closed, so no bees can get in my room because the windows like to slide down. Alright, let's kill these assholes. You know, it's fun. It's a fun time when the bees decide, and basically, hornets, honeybees, yellow jackets decide to make their hive directly under your fucking window. That's fun. That's real fun. And because of the way the siding's put up on the house, when it rains, it doesn't get rid of the hive. They have a nice little. Under, they have a nice little molding to hide under. Ugh.
Okay, I want to head straight to the wall. Okay, I want to go past one on the door. Go this way. And I want to go through that room. After I deal with this asshole. More cocksuckers, lovely. Okay, heal us all up, please. All right, and through here should be our Intelligence, second intelligence incense. And it's guarded by a bunch of Yamas. Yamas are... Where are you on this thing? Ah, you're Chaos. Yeah, you guys can cast Mudo, can't you? Yep. Well, that's one down. Looks like I'll be heading back to the Messiah Church. Of course, you had to get your fucking turns off first. I keep forgetting how big these HP sponges are getting. They're actually fucking boss fights with the amount of health that we're getting up to. I wish you guys didn't have so much fucking health. How are you guys not dead yet? Seriously. Really? This gun is so fucking unreliable when I need it to be. Fine, just fucking kill it! For God's sake! 
Oh, Temple Knights, I'm not so worried about you, punks. You shouldn't have buffed your attack. You probably should have lowered my accuracy or your defense or upped your defense, you idiots. See, that's what happens when you don't do things the proper way. You die. Hey, Ibaraki. Well, I got some money back, which is gonna cost me a pretty penny to, uh... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, let's use this. And let's see, our intelligence is now at 19, so technically I need to level up three more times in order to get that up to 20. Or I could just say fuck it and leave it at 17 and just start bumping up my strength to increase my HP again. Actually, no, that would be stamina I actually need to increase. Eh. Choices, choices. Well, no matter what, Werewolf is dead, so let's go fix that right now. Now that I know where I can actually, you know, get this items. Okay. Plus, it's good to head back to the terminal anyway to reset the map locations. Okay, let's uh, let's go into Masa the Messiah Temple. I need to purchase items from you. Buy. Soul incense. All right, here's hoping this works. Excellent werewolf is back from the grave. Now it's time to summon him again. There he is. Actually, since I'm down here, I have 3,000, and you've got... What armor pieces do I need to get you? Basically everything else. All right, well, let's start doing some fusions then. Really? Really? You know, I'm perfect, I'm perfect, yeah. To be uh, perfectly honest, I'm surprised that Chaos Demons are allowed to be in the so-called Messiah headquarters. Because you would think an area that's meant to be the Messiah cult's headquarters, or at least one of them, they would not have Chaos Demons running around. It'd be nothing but the lawful side. Whatever. Ow. You jackasses. It's not nice that one of them two of my demons are weak to fire. And of course we can throw all the ones that are almost dead, so it doesn't fucking matter.
Okay, let's do that again. Oh, and yay, another magic stone. Okay, into the cathedral. Wow, Raj and I are confused with a lot of things. Okay, Yoki, Persky, Hobgoblin, and Rusulka. Okay, what do Hobgoblin and Rusulka fuse into? Is it Eros again? Yes, it is. That's, an, that's not gonna happen. No, it's not alright. What about Ibaraki and Persky? What do they fuse into? They fuse into a gnome! I don't need gnome for much of anything, really. At least that's not I can think of. Well, Wendigo, Wonka, can I fuse you yet? I'm not high enough level, am I? Nope. Actually, I can get rid of Kusif because you could take us directly to the terminal itself, so I can finally get rid of him. Let's fuse Rasulka, Kusif, and Wendigo together to see what happens. We already have Yaxini. She's level 30. That could be that needs to be fixed. God damn it, I clicked the wrong button. What about Quanka? That also is Yaxini. Why don't we just have Yakshini with them as well, see what they get. That gives me a slime. No thanks. Let's do Windigo and Quonka to see what they fuse with. Well, okay, we can make another werewolf. You know what the hell with it? Persky, Ibaraki. Let's fuse ourselves a gnome. At the very least, let's get some fucking space up in this bitch. Let's see, what can Gnome do for my party? What the hell does a 1 or a 2 mean? Oh yeah, I also have a fusion chart. Of course, that doesn't really tell me much of anything when you don't give me a uh, key for what you're talking about. God damn it. Whatever. Gnome plus Rusulka equals... Kelpie, which is technically better. Okay, if a 1 is a higher tier, what happens when we do Gnome plus Yakshini? 
That's a two. What does the two represent? Apparently two stages. What about Quanka? That gives me a giant. Holy fuck. I can't fuse that demon that high of a level. Not even if I tried. Okay, well, Yaxini, you're getting upgraded. And to Mizuki. Let's begin the fusion. I can't help but feel like Mizuki is not supposed to be someone with a horse head. Maybe I'm just being weird. Fuse three demons, let's just get them out of the team. Uh when to go. Wonka plus Kusif, what do you make? A werewolf. That fucking monstrosity is a thing. Uh... Okay, Koo is the werewolf, okay. Which means I could re get get werewolf back. Yusulka. Plus Hobgoblin. What about Rajanaga? Equals this thing. Fuck it. Well, now I can recruit more demons at the very least. Yeah, I probably should head up to the healing church. Or I could get more pieces of armor. Let's check out the armor shop. Sort items by item type, please. Thank you very much, good sir. Bye. Nope, I need a lot more cash. Never mind. Healing Shrine it is. Get Yuka's MP back to full. It's this one, right? Yep. Recover, require your healing services, priest. Okay, everyone's back up. Okay, let's go get that uh, last incense, the strength one. Okay. Oh, wrong direction. This way. Okay, so essentially we have to take the same path as before. Or do I want to get the 
Let's run down the hallway to get the core shield. That's not that far. Excellent. Oh yeah. I may have lost some of the potential to status affect my enemies to hell, but I gained a very powerful attacker in the process. I'll take it. You know what, I'll try. Hey Lamia, you wanna try to join my team? And I really should have uh, checked what alignment you are, but whatever. Oh wait, Yoju, right? Kaiju? Ah, uh, fuck it. Hello. Kijo. Kijo is a It's probably spelled differently from what's on here. So I might as well just check. Ah, Chaos Demon. Oh, there. Okay, now that I actually see it, I see it on the fucking chart. There it is. Well, more fusion material at the very least. Okay. Do I want to recruit you just to so I have to stop running into your fucking mug? Yes. Sure. And of course he doesn't trust me. Here we go with this bullshit. How much my party is going to die today? You know what? Fuck it. Let's see if this works on your ass. Well, it's one gone. Well, that was... Unexpected. Well, great, we're dead. You have 335 health, that explains a bit. Okay, so Kazi is dead. That's great. Holy ball sacks. Okay, just for the sake of curiosity. 
item, use magic stone. These items are affected by the magic stats, aren't they? Son of a bitch. Okay. How much is it going to cost to revive Kazuya? Probably a shit ton. Yep, a shit ton. That's the same cost as reviving Werewolf when he's dead. Ugh. Well, it looks like I'm going to be farming up for another Soul Incense, and Yuka's probably going to be ahead in the level department by doing that. Alright. Ah, uh, the mapper spell expires on New Moon. That's fine, I can walk in circles. Persky, guess what? You're gonna get zapped to death. Actually... Now that I have someone who can actually do extra electricity attacks, I can start making use of this now. And this last casting of magic, this last round should be enough to kill them off entirely. But the very least it'll kill one off. Alright, get zapped. You're under 87 damage, oh jeez. Oh, you punks. Get bit, get mauled to death. Actually, with the Zells, that should be enough for... Yep. Hello. Oh, only Kazuya can talk to demons. Oh, no. That's not good. That's not good. Let's not uh, try. I need a soul incense, please. Stop asking for donations, you fucking greedy assholes. You should be providing your services and items for free! Well, the Church of God should be doing it for free because of charity and goodwill and all that bullshit, but it's just a fucking lie. We are teleporting directly to the thing, even though it's a waste of MP, but I don't care. I am not taking the chance of it failing on my on the main character. God damn it! Uh, actually, I am practically I am five. God damn. You know what, fuck it, this is a good time as any, even though there's five minutes remaining. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been NoGod21, this has been Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei 1. In the next video, we're going to revive Kazuya.
get the last incense that's on this floor and head to the second floor. Which is going to be where we get some more incenses and Kazuya's new brand new weapon. But until then, thanks for watching a wonderful evening, and I'll see you all next time.